And a nonprofit group in southern Utah is working to protect and support abused children, all while donning leather vests and revving their engines. Now we are talking about the St. George chapter of Bikers Against Child Abuse. And as ABC4's Katie Corrales tells us, their purpose, ensure victims feel safe as possible as they cope with their abuse. Members of Bikers Against Child Abuse say that if you hear a bike rolling through your neighborhood late at night, it's likely they're making sure an abused child feels protected. We're there to protect them and we'll do whatever it takes. BACA members say they're ready 24 hours a day to be there for an abused child. At times, they're called to surround a victim's home with bikes and bodies when the child's safety is threatened. And members remain there until the child feels safe again. These kids that we come for, they get it. They know that we're here for them. We're not here for a court system. We're not here for anything but them. The bikers even head to court when the victims testify against their abusers. They say they give support and encouragement before the child goes on the stand. You know, to be themselves, to tell the truth, to be honest, and that we're here for them. BACA members say they also teach about abuse at school assemblies, discussing subjects such as good touch, bad touch, and secret touch. They encourage kids to reach out to an adult they trust if they ever feel scared or unsafe. For more information on the organization and ways you can help prevent child abuse, you can head to our website at abc4.com. Reporting in St. George, Katie Corrales, ABC4 News. The Bikers, or BACA, was founded in Utah in 1995, has more than 30 chapters, eight of those are in our state.